Today we're going to look at an artist named James Rizzi, and then we're going to be doing a picture inspired by him. So here is a painting by James Rizzi. As you can see, he did really fun paintings with lots of color, lots of things going on, almost cartoony. He's a very recent artist. This one is called Cruising with Love. You can see this really cool boat out here. Maybe it's a cruise boat. I'll show you a couple other paintings by him. There's one with cats. I know you love cats. A lot of you really like these. Got lots of students who love to draw cats. Look at all the different colors. Ever seen a pink cat? No. Neither have I, but it didn't stop him. And there's one with a taxi. A lot of us love to draw cars. And they're really lively, fun paintings. I'm going to show you that one with the boat again. So today we're going to do a boat, kind of like this. We'll do like a, a cruise ship or a ferry. Okay, so let's get started with our boat. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to draw a little kind of straight wavy line across the bottom to be... Um, to be the water. Okay, so this will be our water. I'm just using a pencil right now. And then we're going to come up and have the front of the ferry boat. Be nice and big. And that can be the back, nice and straight. Okay, so we've got one level. So there are going to be a few levels to this boat because it's a very big one. And I'll have another. So right here we have kind of a rectangle, it's kind of pointy in the front. And then we'll just kind of put another rectangular layer on top of it. And another one a little bit shorter. Rectangle on top of that. And then we'll make these kind of steam stacks, smoke stacks up here. I'll make those taller rectangles. You can do as many as you like. Do a few different layers for the boat and then you can do a few um, smoke stacks at the top. Okay, time to put some color in here. So you can be very imaginative with your color on this project, um, but I want to put in some different things like we'll do kind of a stripe here. I'm going to use a crayon here and we'll put some portholes. So on a boat, water is always going to be splashing against the sides of the boat. Waves can even go way up the sides of the boat. So they have to make sure water can't come in the windows. They have to be nicely sealed in. So they make these round windows called portholes and they're sealed in really, really well. I can do a few layers of these so that people can see out. The passengers on the ferry boat. A ferry would take you from the land out to an island and back and forth. Sometimes you can put boats on the ferry stripes on the top of these. Okay, so we've got these. Now we can fill it in with some different colors. Let's see, some of these could be green. You can use markers in here. You can use crayons. You could use watercolor paint. Whatever you want. I'm gonna make sure I have a nice, strong outline for my boat. So you can really see the different layers and the shapes. So we've kind of put these shapes together, shapes that you know, like rectangles and circles, to make a picture. And something else, make a boat. There we go. And now I think we'll go for some
for some blue stripes here. Make a pattern like there's a railing here or something. different patterns are very interesting to look at. And I'll do some pink portholes here. Maybe that's the dining deck where they get their snacks. And I'll put some yellow ones up here. can be stripes and different portholes, different places on here. And now at the top, that will be a good, another good place to add some color. It's this crayon right here. Pull this in. There we go. So the fairy's looking pretty good. I'm going to leave the rest of it white, and now all I'm going to do is um, make some ocean waves. So I'm going to use the side of my crayon here so I can put some greenish blue ocean. for the sky. Another blue, but a different color blue. I think before I put that in, I might put some clouds in. And then I can start filling in with the side of my crayon. But I'm just gonna carefully go around if you want to use something else, like markers or something, you absolutely can. You can do this pro this um, project with anything. Crayons, markers, paint. Maybe you could do it outside in chalk. some blue sky around my around my boat it really stands out well make sure that, that outlines there there we go here we have it the ferry boat to take you to an island hope you have a great week and more projects next week bye bye